Right, good morning everyone. Around here at the runoff, I'm standing in the paddock that we direct drilled with uh, Hogan, which is the uh, annual ryegrass. Um, I've got the plate meter here with me, and what we're going to do is we're going to compare the paddock over there, and the paddock just over the driveway there, and the one that I'm standing, we're going to see how much um, grass is in them. The, that one there, and the one on the other side of the driveway grazed before this one. So in theory, those ones should have more grass in it than uh, the paddock that we've got Hogan in because it was grazed after them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to plate them now. We're going to see which one uh, has the most grass in. So we can actually compare them to see, uh, to see uh, how much it's growing. Alright, so I've done 10 plunges, I'm going to do the same in every paddock so that, well, just keeps it fair. Right, so, and with the paddock that's got Hogan annual ryegrass in, uh, it's got um, 25.58 kgs of dry matter per hectare, and now we're going to go and have a look in the next paddock. Right, so now we're in the paddock over the driveway. We're gonna quickly do 10 plunges. We'll reset it. And we're gonna go for it. Right, so that's 10 plungers. I'll show you what it is. 21.52, so there's already a difference, quite a considerable difference. Better go and write this down so that I don't forget it. Right, so now we're in our last paddock, we'll plate. Right, so I've done 10. So, I might, I don't know which of these two paddock, the other uh, two paddocks are comparing the Hogan to, which one was grazed first, but I presume that it was this one because this one is longer than the one over the road. So it was 24.46. That's kgs of dry matter a hectare. Right, so I've just uh, plate metered the paddocks. Um, this paddock over the driveway here, um, this one here would be old pasture. I don't think this one has had any new pasture put into it, or I mean old rye. So that is the 2152 
um, this paddock here, which I'm pretty sure is some newer pasture, but I don't know if it's Shogun. I'm just, I think it might be, but um, it's still it's still growing well. Um, just it's not growing as well as the Hogan. Um, I think that's a pretty good comparison of uh, how this grass grows. Um, I think we'll be definitely be putting more of this uh, Hogan in this season, direct drilling it. And none of these paddocks here have had nitrogen yet. Um, I am going to come and give this paddock some nitrogen just to help it keep going. Um, and also the other three that got drilled just over there. Um, so, yeah. There you go, there's a comparison. And we'll see how it keeps growing through the rest of the winter. Uh, it's obviously still quite warm now, so it's going to get colder. So these uh, paddocks are going to slow down more. This will slow down as well, but I'm hoping it'll keep growing more than the other paddocks. Uh, yeah. All right. I'm off home now. Get cleaned up and head off to the hospital. Thanks for watching. Uh, check us out on Facebook, Family Farming and Fun. You can also um, check out our other videos. Subscribe, click like if you like them. Thumbs down if you don't like them. And put any questions or comments below and I'll have a go at answering them. Thanks for watching. Bye.